do you know that if you want to create a professional logo there are three different aspect to it the first aspect is the color combination of your channel or your website the second aspect is how you choose your title of the name of your website or your youtube channel and the third one is the graphic so we'll be explaining you all the three aspects in detail and we'll also be explaining you how you can convert an image like this to this so without further ado let's jump in now let us go to a website first where we'll be discussing how you can make your photo transparent now to do it what you can do is we can go to a website called as remove.bg okay remove.bg i'll make sure to add the link of this website in the description okay you can just go and upload upload the photo for which you want to remove the background okay so let us choose a photo okay and give it a minute so what it will do basically is it will remove the background of the photo right so now we want to download it okay now if you see guys the the photo is transparent now okay now if you see the earlier photo was not transparent it is having a green background in the back this photo here you have a green background in the back but i have just converted it to a transparent photo now you may be thinking how basically we can use this particular photos okay now to do it what you can do is you can go to canva.com where i can explain you how you can use all these things in your logo right now here if you see now here if you see the background is actually a gray background okay and i have used my photo which is transparent right now if you make your photo transparent it looks a much better in terms of designing a graphic right so if you just move it like this it seems like you are there and uh, the content that you are publishing is behind your back because you your photo is basically transparent right so this is the benefit of making a photo transparent it looks much professional so normally i recommend people to make their photo transparent so that it has a good professional appealing design attached to it right now that we know how to make a photo transparent by the way this photo is my channel's channel art where we'll be discussing on how we can create a design like this for your channel in the next video right now let us move to this particular section where we'll be discussing what colors you should use for your social media account or for your website or for your youtube channel now to do it there are a lot of things that you have to consider the first thing that we'll be discussing is who are the customer base whom you are targeting okay so let us take an example you have a channel which is into fashion so and you want to target the audience who, who are girls and women so in that case you have to choose a color which is basically related to pink because that is a feminine color if you are choosing a niche which is into the boys or you know kind of men's niche then you can choose a color something similar to blue right now the second thing that is important is the tone okay so what i mean by tone is if you are in a niche where you are creating a channel where the colors the the content is like very playful and it is very comedy type or it is kind of very interactive type then you can use a playful color so what are the playful colors colors like yellow orange uh, green these are the playful colors which can interact with public right otherwise if you have a very serious channel something like a news channel or uh, some channel which basically describes about the serious aspects then you can use some dark colors so dark colors are something like gray black stuff like that right and so it depends on your channel your audience whom you are targeting okay now the third thing is about the emotion aspect now what do i mean by emotion aspect 
okay now each color basically describes some emotion by themselves right now when you see a red color what basically you feel is something like a dangerous or confident or stuff like that okay so that is the inherent capability of a red color okay so similarly if you choose a orange color so i'm sorry i i don't know why this is not orange so it, should, it is it's just not orange but just pardon me for that now orange is a color which basically describes friendly and change uh, kind of behavior so your if your channel is basically dealing something related to this niche then you can use the orange color green we all know if you are in a natural or healthy kind of niche where you can give a signal to the people that this we're talking about something related to health something about the nature then you can use green blue is a symbol of trust and security okay so if you are creating some videos like videos in the stock market then you can use this colors right so you just have to make sure that using the right color for your channel and making your channel's theme ensuring with the right color combination and this is very very critical guys people used to make decision 60 to 90 percent of the people used to make decision by looking at the color in a subconscious, subconscious level so this is very very critical guys okay now the third aspect that we are going to discuss today is how basically you can create the name of your channel right now to create the name of the channel there are five things that you have to consider the first thing is that you have to keep it short okay so what you want is your audience should remember it now to remember it you don't want to make your channel's name a very long one so that people don't re remember it okay so some of the examples are fedex bmw apple redmi pepsi these are the names that you can easily remember okay so this is the first trick whenever you are making sure that you're creating a name for your channel make sure that it is very very easy and short okay the second thing that you can consider is make it easy to memorize what i mean by easy to memorize it is you can basically use the words for which you're working so for example redverse is a website which basically deals with the tickets of the bus right uh, a lot of people already may be aware okay so now when they're using red bus and attaching a red color and then attaching bus it is very easy to memorize right similarly drugs.com dealing with you know drugs and pharmaceuticals okay so easily people able to memorize this is this is the second thing that you can consider for your channel or for your website right the third thing that you can use to create the name of for your channel is symmetry so what do i mean by symmetry is that you can basically use name something like range rover or american airlines where the first letter of both the words are same okay kit kat johnson and johnson paypal if you observe closely the name of these two words are the same p p j j k k a a r r okay so it gives a very smooth tuning to the word and it is very easy to memorize okay so this is something that you can ensure to give a good branding image to your name okay now the next thing that we're going to talk about is use a catchy name now what do i mean by catchy name is that the words which fit into people's memory something like coke yahoo google okay so these are the names which basically fits into our memory very very easily maggie ford stuff like that it gets into our subconscious mind very very easily right the next aspect is connect to a desire okay so imagine somebody is telling you we have a company called as loansapproved.com so what do you understand from that you understand that this particular company is giving loans body trim trimming the body shape on site emergency or on time emergency giving emergency services to the people right so it is an emotion attached to the name which basically directly translate and directly translate the message that the company wants to convey to you right so you can use this, this particular strategy if you want to create in this particular niche if you want to work in this specified niche where you want to translate your message by your name itself so guys that's it for today's video i'll see you in the next video in the next video we'll be discussing about how you can make a effective channel art for your channel i'll see you in my next video until then bye bye keep safe